know, were you? It wouldn't be good. The state of the books in Victoria were worse than predicted. A fiscal disgrace, with net debt headed for $171.4 billion, with no Fed income plan to pay back borrowings outside what the Andrews government spent in a mad panic during COVID. I would have said this was a budget designed to persuade the last Victorian leaving the state to please turn out the lights, except by the time that happens, by the time Dan Andrews gets through closing all the coal-fired power stations and recreating the SEC powered by wind and solar, there won't be any lights on in the state anyway. This was a dreadful budget to reflect a dreadful situation. I mean, give me a break, Peter. Dan Andrews is claiming that COVID made him do it. I didn't think it was appropriate. COVID made him create all mm. this extra mm -hmm. debt. That doesn't get you very far because why did we get all this extra spending in COVID far more than the other states? Because we had those six lockdowns. <laughs> it's just science, eh? <laughs> Mind-blowing, isn't it? He's also claiming that Phil Lowe, the Reserve Bank governor, made him do it. Buy out and borrow all that extra money. I didn't think it was appropriate.